Let me start by asking you a simple question. Why did you start learning biology? When did you decide to make biology your profession? Let me know in the comment section. So biology you fell in love with during your probably your 10th or plus 2 ex exams or before that or maybe during the bachelors. You fell in love with biology and then you said you want it to be your career. But after that, people told you that the only way forward for a biology student is you can become a medical doctor. And then they pushed you into that competition that you have to qualify some exams, go through all those crazy notes and become a doctor. Right? But you know, the problem with medical doctor is not that you are less qualified or you are less talented. The truth is, majority country have less number of seats in medicine. So suppose if there are 16 lakh, that is 1.6 million people in India who are writing the medical exam, there are hardly 80,000 seats left. Only 80,000 seats are there. So imagine that 16 lakh people, 1.6 million people are writing this exam, only 80,000 seats are there. So obviously you, you could not get in here. What if there was say um, 1 million seats, then obviously you could have become a doctor easily, right? The truth is because of less number of seats, you are feeling that I was less t talented. That's why I could not make it. That's not truth. So stop underestimating yourself, right? Now coming to today's topic, which is how can you still pursue biology and become a very successful professional, earn a lot of money? And that is what we can talk in this video. All right. So like I said, this option is no more applicable. We have better option. Now, somebody said, hey, if you want to become a bio professional, then you have to do a degree in biotech. But at the same time, there are a lot of people saying that there is no future, no scope, no, you know, whatever in biotech, which I don't agree to. But yeah, so biotech is the real future of a biology student. Okay, so you pursued biotech. After that, what happens? What should you do? So that is where this one skill can help you. Now, it can help you no matter whether you are a biotech student or you have already passed and you have 20 years of experience and you are still not successful. If you had a career break, no matter what you are, if you are in or you want to come into the biotech sector, this one skill is going to change everything. Okay. Now, let's talk about the video technology. Like right now we're talking, right? You're listening to me. I am uh, talking to you. Whatever you want to convey, you'll comment below and I will read and I'll re reply to that, right? So that's how exactly technology works, right? So biotech is also tech. The only problem with biotech is we have to do everything in a lab, right? So we need to play with chemicals. We need to play with protocols. We need to play with a lot of different conditions in the laboratory to achieve success and that's what we call it as experiment right i'll just short it and write experiment expt so you do experiment right now when you do experiment what happens next you generate a lot of data right now this data this data has to be interpreted now if it is just like two three readings or five readings or 100 readings also fine you can just you know, use your calculator, regular computer to achieve that. But after that, what happens? If What if this data is in terabytes or let's say petabytes? I'm sure you must have heard of petabytes, right? So what if the data is in terabytes and petabytes? Biological data in terabytes, petabytes. Your computer will hang, it will crash, right? It will collapse. So that is where you need this one skill. It is called as bio Infomatics, right? So matics comes out from the root word maths. Info, information, that's data, and bio, which is obviously biology. Biological information interpreted using maths, as simple as that. Like I told you earlier, we are able to talk because you are in different time zone, I'm in a different time zone. I recorded this on a different day. You're watching me on a different day, but we can still talk, right? You can comment and I can talk. Same way, this technology helps us interpret data. You will not believe even medical doctors today are approaching us to learn bioinformatics. Question is, bioinformatics was al al always there. See, bioinformatics were was there in the year 2000 also. Bioinformatics was there in 2010 also. 
then why the buzz now the real reason is bioinformatics now is more relevant thanks to the development in the last two years and that is called as ai ml artificial intelligence machine learning now with the advent of smarter computers stronger computers using ai ml we can do more things so now scientists are like okay biological data we use bioinformatics to interpret extrapolate you find patterns find the reason would what can prediction prediction part we can take care of using ai ml ai ml is making bioinformatics fashionable again now like i said you do you need a degree to learn you know operate a computer no right the same way you don't need any degree to you know learn bioinformatics all it takes is maximum of 6 months 30 days of group training with us and another uh, 180 days of project with us and then you are good to go as simple as that publish some papers build a reputation now another thing here now what happens is the moment you learn artificial intelligence machine learning you can use biological data in a better way so you can predict you can find patterns you can uh, do things which was never possible and now you can create that algorithm and sell it to companies and that is where you make a lot of money so if you are a biotech student or a medical doctor also the real money will be made when you learn artificial intelligence machine learning and to learn ai ml you should also learn by informatics that is where the trick is and now people come to me okay what languages i should learn r python this is more than enough to you know become a master of all the three learn coding for biologists from biotechnica link in the description learn bioinformatics do some projects in ai ml using bioinformatics drug discovery and then publish papers and then you see this one skill can give you a starting salary of 15 lakhs per annum and that is a salary package which i'm telling for a startup the established companies are giving 30 lakh per annum salary also for a person who has 2 to 3 years of experience in ai ml and bioinformatics if you learn this tech you can win and biotechnica is right here to help you all you have to do is go ahead click the link in the description okay thank you so much for watching this video do comment below if you have any questions i'll definitely uh, look into them reply to them or make a video out of them thank you take care keep shining bye bye